a needle in a haystack. That's what it was like for one group of ASU researchers who were the first to find a set of meteorites that fell from the meteor which lit up the Arizona sky a few weeks ago. People saw it and people heard it. Pieces of the meteor that had Arizonans talking for weeks have now been recovered. A team of Arizona State researchers went out last week and searched tirelessly for these little rocks with a big impact. They're scientifically invaluable. I mean, they, we know that this thing has not been on the ground long at all. Found the first small stone. That was amazing news. That said, here they are. The meteorites were found on the White Mountain Apache tribal land. The ASU researchers were the only team with special access to the area. Now the pieces are being held within these walls of the Center for Meteorite Studies until the tribe grants them access to fully study and examine them. 4.5 billion years. That's how old these meteorites are. The team went out and found about 15 pieces just like this. The exciting thing for them? There's more. Now we can go back to the to that original location so we, we can actually put all the pieces that we found together. There are only five to 10 recovered meteorites a year in the world. And in Arizona, there have only ever been four. They give us a perspective of how the solar system material that went into building these bigger planets was and what were the phenomena or time scales of these events that happened in the early solar system. The research team and the chairman of the White Mountain Apache tribe are currently negotiating another trip to recover more of these pieces. And this week, the Center for Meteorite Studies will have a display of these meteorites open to the public on the ASU campus. For more information, visit cronkitenews.azpbs.org for the full digital report. In the Broadcast Center, Christina Tatro, Cronkite News.